preposterous that any of us are alive. Maybe we're not. Pinch yourself and check we're not dreaming the last of our lives as we die screaming! <laughs> you are wide awake, and Raphael truly is defeated. Then we're not just fine, we're spectacular! What a wonderful, jubilant, glorious day. <gasps> but my poor sister, Carilla. It is not right that she died. And that makes me want to weep an ocean. She was an entire person before she ever made that choice. When we were children, she always kept the last piece of pastry for me and bloodied the nose of the bullies who pulled my hair. She was my sister. You don't know the half of what she did. When we were children, she always kept the last piece of pastry for me and bloodied the nose of the bullies who pulled my hair. She was my sister. When we were children, she always kept the last piece of pastry for me and bloodied the nose of the bullies who pulled my hair. She was my sister. But as a wise woman once said, there's no point in crying over spilt blood. We must go on. And despite all the years I've lost, I have enough love in my heart to guide you home. For the first time since you heard her voice, hope seems calm, and the peace flows from her into you, soothing your very soul. that any of us are alive. Maybe we're not. Pinch yourself and check we're not dreaming the last of our lives as we die screaming! <laughs> you are wide awake, and Raphael truly is defeated. Then we're not just fine, we're spectacular! What a wonderful, jubilant, glorious day. My beautiful sister is mostly intact. You could have broken her in half like a breadstick, but you didn't. I am sorry she fought you. I'm glad she survived. You don't know the half of what she did. When we were children, she always kept the last piece of pastry for me and bloodied the nose of the bullies who pulled my hair. She's my sister. I love her. She deserves some of the blame. Serving him was a choice. But she was an entire person before she ever made that choice. When we were children, she always kept the last piece of pastry for me and bloodied the nose of the bullies who pulled my hair. She's my sister. I love her. I hope so too. She's my sister. I love her. And despite all the years I've lost, I have enough love left for you as well. I hope it guides you home. For the first time since you heard her voice, hope seems calm, and the peace flows from her into you, soothing your very soul. You were all the luck I needed. And go where? I don't think I quite know how to be anywhere else but here anymore. With a lick of paint and a thorough cleaning, this could be a lovely little house. And I can hardly leave. After all, who would ever want to think of hell without hope? I hope. I'll see Carilla again one day, and that she'll say sorry, and I'll tell her she's forgiven. I hope I find all the pieces of my mind that fell out of my head over all those years, and that I'll be able to put myself back together again. I hope the echoes of pain will fade, 
and memories of sorrow will die. And that you'll visit me here someday. And I hope you have a happy ending of your own. <laughs>